welcome to my zone online school. My name is Linda Shipanga and welcome to my friend. Today's lesson is grade 7 science. But before we start with our lesson, remember to put on your mask and let's also sanitize our hands. Let's rub it through our fingers and around our hands. And also do not forget the social distance on the sides and to the front as well. Now, today's lesson is health education, sexuality, and sexual health. Please turn to page 23. Health education, sexuality, and sexual health. Now, let's quickly look at our competencies. Identify from diagrams the different stages of sexual development from infancy to old age. Investigate and report on different sources of information and support about sexual health and sexuality. Explain what constitutes sexual health, be it physical or emotional. Explain why sexual health is important. Now the vocabulary. Sexuality. Sexuality is the physical and emotional readiness for sexual intercourse. Sexual health. Being physically, mentally, socially healthy in relation to sexuality. Let's turn to page 24, where we have different diagrams or pictures on the stages of the human development. Now, on the chalkboard, we have different stages of sexual development. The first stage is a baby or infant, and then we have the childhood. The next stage is the adolescent, and the next stage will be the adulthood, as you can see, and the last stage is the old age. Now, let's move on to the sources of information and support about sexual health and sexuality. You know, as young uh, children, as adolescents, you need to have information on sexual health and your sexuality. But your friends are not really that well equipped with information. So you need to visit different places that can offer you with good quality information. These places, we call them the sources of information on sexuality and sexual health. Now, these places are the clinics and hospitals, the lifeline and child line, the woman and child protection unit. Now we are moving on to what constitutes sexual health, be it physical or emotional. What constitutes sexual health, you, should, you shouldn't only be physically healthy, be it you preventing yourself from getting STDs or sexually transmitted diseases. It should, you should also have a positive and a respectful approach to sexuality and sexual relationships. That's basically what constitutes sexual health. Now, why is it important for you to be healthy sexually? So that you can live a happy life, to avoid getting infections, and to avoid unwanted pregnancies. Let's turn to page 25. On page 25, you can find your activity. This is activity one. Number one, identify the stages of sexual development from the diagrams below. You should just fill in the, sp in the spaces provided. Number two, explain why sexual health is important. I hope you have enjoyed your, this lesson. And please remember to sanitize your hands and always put on your mask. So goodbye. Hi everyone, I'm Joshi. And make sure to always make a helicopter circle stretching your arms out and spinning around like me. And make sure you're not touching anyone while doing this. Goodbye.